Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com and today we're going to take a look at this Shocker Hitch Air Cushioned Gooseneck Surge Coupler. Now this shock absorbing gooseneck coupler has this 4 inch wide square inner tube that is going to fit in your outer tube of your crank style gooseneck couplers. Now this features an industrial strength airbag and cushioned bump stops and let me give you an overhead view real quick so you can hopefully get a better view of those bump stops there and uh, the airbag and the bump stops are going to allow you to have a much smoother more comfortable ride when you are towing your trailer the airbag and bump stops help dampen the jerking and road shock that you often experience when you are towing your gooseneck trailer now the way this air cushion coupler works is when your trailer jerks forward or jolts forward or pulls backward that's going to cause this to pivot and it's going to transfer that energy to the airbag and to the bump stops there and uh, so that airbag and those bump stops are going to absorb that energy and as a result you're going to get a much smoother ride this also gives you the added benefit of extending the life of your truck and trailer by protecting them from unnecessary wear and tear now this has a gross towing weight of 30,000 pounds and a vertical load limit of 6,000 pounds. And the airbag is really easy to adjust with this valve and this valve also has a cap as well. So that's going to be very easy to adjust that airbag. You're just going to add more air if you have a heavier load and let some air out for a lighter load. This is going to be a pretty easy uh, install and again I just want to give you a overhead view once again and uh, so when when you are uh, installing this uh, square inner tube into your square uh, outer tube it's going to be a good idea to have another person help you lift this into place uh, this weighs right around a hundred pounds I needed help getting this lifted on my table. So just be aware of that. The install is going to be pretty easy, but uh, it's going to be a great idea to have an extra pair of hands to help you lift this into place. This is a, definitely a heavy duty item. Now hooking up to your two and five sixteenths inch gooseneck ball is going to be pretty easy. This is going to be very easy to use with this lockable lever. It's going to let you connect and disconnect the coupler from your hitch ball. And you're simply going to use the lever to engage or disengage the locking mechanism. So let me just turn this around here. You get this tethered uh, safety pin, and then you're just going to remove that pin from the lever. And as you can see, it's in the locked position right now, but if I move it into the unlocked position, you see those bars moving. That's going to uh, disengage the ball. And then you can, le you can put this, uh, lock this rather, into the unlocked position just like that. But what I like about this is it's very easy to see uh, the, the lock position here. So when you lock that into place, you see that hole there hopefully, and you just slide your pin through there, and then those bars are going to be locked around that, that uh, gooseneck ball. Now it's probably gonna be pretty easier if I just show you a picture of what's going on on the inside. On the left hand side, you see uh, um, that's what's going to look like when this is actually locked and engaged around your gooseneck ball. You see those bars, those bars are going to uh, slide right underneath that ball and that's how it locks into place. When you disengage this, those bars are going to move out as you saw in our demonstration and it has a little cutout there on the right hand side that you see there and that's going to allow your gooseneck ball to slide in and out of that coupler. So it's a really simple design, but very effective as well. It's going to, with, that, with those uh, dual locking bars, it's going to uh, not only hold that, bar, that ball into place, but it's also going to help uh, reduce rattle as well. Now this does feature an offset design, 
which is going to give you nine inches of extra clearance between your truck cab and trailer. So this is really going to be ideal for your short bed pickup trucks and where you need that additional um, cab clearance when you're making those uh, sharper turns when you're hooked up to your uh, trailer. And this also has a grease Zerk fitting. I just wanted to point that out right there. Maintenance is going to be very simple and so that Zerk fitting is going to allow you to uh, lubricate that pivot point. Again, it's going to be very easy to do. This is made here in the USA of steel tubing and 4140 cast and the, and the 4140 cast steel socket is going to provide you maximum durability. This is shot blasted and powder coated to prevent rust. So it's, it looks great and uh, I think it's going to be very long lasting, especially with that finish. You just want to make sure that you maintain that finish to prevent any rust or corrosion buildup. Now, I do want to make a, uh, an important note. If you have a recessed gooseneck ball, there must be at least a 12 inch by 12 inch opening in your bed for this coupler to work. In addition, the top of the hitch ball cannot be more than two inches from the top of the bed. Now instructions are included and this is going to walk you through the very easy installation process. So if you often feel uh, beat up from the bumps uh, on, in the road and you're looking for something to take out that jerking and the bounce when you are towing your trailer, this is really going to be a great item for you to consider. Well, that's going to conclude our look today. I do hope that it was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.